Okay, so you wanna improve your nollies, right? In today's video, I'm gonna be telling you one simple tip that helped me improve my nollies drastically. So I'm pretty much gonna cut straight to the chase. So the main tip that helped me improve my knowledge and get better height on them, more control, is that instead of popping straight down with your leading foot, right, you wanna actually like pop forward. So you give it like almost a little nudge pop forward. And the reason for that is because if you think of it, if you're leaning too far over your nose when doing this trick and you're popping straight down, you're not really, I guess, getting like a full snap out of it, you're kind of like weighing too much on your front foot. So actually giving that little nudge allows you to get a better angle to slide your back foot on the back so that you can actually get it up higher. So there is like another tip that you kind of had to do alongside with that tip. Like first you're gonna lean over your front foots to start off with, but then as you pop and slide up, you kind of almost want to jump backwards or like switch your weight back to the tail. And the reason for this is because if you're leaning too far over your front foot during the entire pop, you're, like I said before, you're kind of weighing down the pop. So if you actually, you know, give it that nudge forward first and then jump a little backwards, you're kind of distributing the weight better so that you're able to slide your foot on the back where you can level it out more. So for me, when I actually did this, it did fix it almost immediately. It may not be the same for you, but just make sure you keep practicing and trying that over and over uh, because I feel like that's honestly gonna help you better than if you're just popping straight down with your leading foot. So I know this is a quick video, but it's not really over yet. So this tip actually did help me recently with my nollie flips. I'm gonna try to land three nollie flips in a row just so I could put into practice what I just said. So it's not like I'm just, you know, giving a whole bunch of hogwash to y'all. So it actually works for some flip tricks. Uh, but for me, it mainly works like just for the nollie, just for the nollie kickflip, but um, any other variation, I haven't really tried it too much with. Maybe I might try it with nollie heels too. We'll see. But for today's video, we're going to do three nollie flips in a row, if I can. We'll see. You see there, I was leaning too far forward, that's why I just shot it back. You have to actually like jump backwards a little bit. What's also helping me is that when I'm doing it, I'm like focusing on staying behind the nose because once you lean too far over the nose, then it's, it's over, you're not going to land it. thing is though, I'm landing more than I usually do, but it's taking a while. I 
think I'm done. All right, everybody, so that's gonna wrap it up for my session. I couldn't get three in a row, but you know, it's completely fine. I also wanna show you guys that, you know, I don't succeed in everything I do within skateboarding. I did get closer and I'm starting to figure out knife flips more than I have before. And that's the most I've landed in like one session. I'm also hoping I got some of the footage because sometimes like I think my camera like stopped filming. So I don't know if I got everything, but I know I did get some knife flips in there. So that was the main point. You know, just trying to prove my point of the popping forward with your leading foot actually helps you get a better nollie. So remember when you're doing your nollies, just pop forward. Also make sure you stay behind the nose and maybe even jump back sometimes because once you lean too far forward, which is what I was doing a lot with that nollie flip, it just does not work. So remember, you gotta pop it forward really hard, make sure you get a solid pop, and then possibly, you know, lean back towards the tail and jump backwards. But otherwise than that, you know, it takes a lot of practice, a lot of time, and you know, that's honestly how you improve your tricks. But I appreciate you guys for watching. We're almost near 75,000 subscribers. I'm gonna be having a giveaway soon. You'll be seeing that whenever I get my new skateboard. So, you know, I'm setting up some for myself, but I also have something to give back too. So make sure you like, comment, subscribe, turn on the post notifications so you can be notified when that video goes up. I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace.